Time, how about that? And experience some of the greatest movies ever made on one of the largest screens around. Cinema at the Square is going on now at Playhouse Square, which I talked about earlier. Welcome Adam Miltner. He is here from Playhouse. I, I just want to say what a great event, a cheap date. Tickets are five bucks, right? Yep. My five husband bucks. and I went Saturday night because Breakfast at Tiffany was, was playing. And the list that you guys have, it's like, I feel like I've seen those movies, but I haven't. Yeah, there's a lot of classics on the series this year, and it's the 15th anniversary, so we really wanted to do something special. Um, so we went back and looked at the attendance from the past 14 years, and we picked the films that were um, the most well attended. So it's kind of a best of this year. Um, and so, you know, there are a lot of films that you know what they are, right. and you know lines from them, but you may not have seen them. Or even all the chance. way through. Yeah, even stars like Audrey Hepburn. You've heard right. that name, and then you saw her in uh, Breakfast at Tiffany's. It was so good. And, and you've got, everyone talks about Alfred Hitchcock. So people, they know the name, but they don't associate a movie with it, and Rear Window is one of the movies. Yeah, which that's is one of my great favorites, ones. too. Yeah, yeah. Um, Jimmy Stewart, Grace Kelly, it's, it's a fantastic story. This is a story about a guy who broke his leg. I think he was a sports photographer, and he sort of like hobbled and stuck in his apartment. So he sits look, staring out the back window all, uh, all the time, and he discovers what he thinks is a guy who may have murdered his wife and, and may be burying her in the flower garden. And it really becomes a great uh, mystery, doesn't it? Yeah, he sees some things that he probably shouldn't see, and, uh, and he gets himself into some trouble. And the acting between Jimmy Stewart and Grace Kelly is just phenomenal. Right. Grace Kelly, she went on to marry a king and become... Princess Grace. Mm -hmm. There you go. Casablanca is another one. Yep. Um, I actually haven't seen that movie, and I get really, out of town. I know it's one of the classics, and I haven't seen it. You know, I, I know so many lines from it. You know, uh, we'll always have Paris, and here's looking at you, kid, and stuff like that. Um, so I'm excited to see that in that environment. Right. Ingrid Bergman is the girl in that. There's Sydney Greenstreet is in this. Peter Lorre is in this. I mean, this is just one of the greatest movies. And this movie, when they made this movie, they had a crummy script. They didn't know what they were going to do with it. A lot of it's improvisation. They'd write part of the script the day before, and it ended up being one of the all-time classic movies. Yeah. Terrific film. Talk about Willy Wonka and the Chocolate Factory. Is this the new Willy Wonka? Nope, it's the classic. Good. The original. Gene Wilder. Yeah. It better be. Not, not a big fan of the Johnny Depp one. Yeah. I'm a, I, <laughs> yeah. How do you really feel, Adam? Yeah, I know. But yeah, this, uh, you know, it's golden ticket. This is, you know, everything that it, it, it's always been, um, the classic Gene Mahler character. Right. Uh, so that, that's another one that's coming up. It's going to be a lot of fun for families, for adults, for everybody. Are they going to be selling chocolate? Yeah, we got a stand? full concessions. Um, Fantastic. Adult beverages, too, so you can, you know, have a beer or a drink while you're seeing the film. A beer with Willy Wonka, that's pretty wild. Isn't it? <laughs> yeah. hey, <laughs> hey, you know what's crazy about this, too, is, you know, a lot of the kids haven't seen this because they don't play old movies like they used to because every cable right. channel is playing brand new movies. That's a new deal. Yeah. So this film will sort of like transport grandparents, aunts and uncles, yeah, even some parents back into a time yeah. when they remember seeing it and be able to turn the kids on to something, something new and really yeah. fantastic. Definitely. How about uh, this next one, too, is really a terrific one. Oh, Mary Poppins, Mary right? Mary Poppins. That is just... If they remake it. this one, they're going to kill somebody over <laughs> it. Yeah. And I don't know if you saw the opening ceremony of the Olympics, but they had all the Mary Poppins characters coming down. Right. So, you know, that's, it just speaks to how iconic this movie is. Yeah. So even if you haven't seen it, you know, it's, it's just something that's so a part of, you know, pop culture. I've got a chance to interview every one of these big stars in this movie sort of recently, and people always bring up Mary Poppins. And no matter what these guys have done since then in their whole career, they everyone has to spend part of the time yeah. of the interview talking about Mary Poppins. I mean, that's how iconic this is. Just a fantastic film. Now, when you see Mary Poppins on Sunday, August 19th, everybody needs to ride their bike there if they have one. Yes, we have a promo going on this year. Where do you park it? It's well, just that's the thing. Yep, it's just inside the state uh, ticket office lobby. Yeah. Um, and we, we're working with an organization called Bike Cleveland, um, and we're doing a promotion where if you bike down to the theater to see a film, um, the, there'll be free parking, and you'll be able to park there for all the films. <laughs> Isn't that cool? Yeah. That's great. You just really you get into the character and you get into it, yeah. and you know, it's just one experience. I think it's just fun. And you know, you get down idea. there early enough and go to Colin Hubbard, that's the restaurant right outside. Oh, yeah, lots Zach of Mo's place. downtown dining. Yeah, so you can definitely turn it into a date night, like what you were saying. Yeah. Ten bucks. Oh, no, I made him buy me a glass of pop and then two different kinds of candy. <laughs> 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 so it could add up a little bit. But we have to go back to Willy Wonka and get some chocolate, right? I do. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm. Adam, thank you for being here. Thanks Cinema for at the Square through the 19th. A lot of fun at the Palace Theater. And if you go to our website or their website, all the listing of the movies and the dates and times are on there too. So Check it's it. different every weekend. Check it out. Make sure you see Casablanca, okay? I will do. Get on that, dude. When we return, <laughs>